The bell rings and the always unpredictable War Games match is set to begin. Unpredictable is putting it lightly, Cole. War Games is where they send superstars who have exhausted all of their options to settle their differences. If it can't be solved here, it can't be solved anywhere. Working against Logan Paul now. Paul has to wake up and fast. Ooh, stinging kick. Oh, what an uppercut. Drop kick finds the spot. We're gonna wear down their opponent. Oh, with the heel hook stretch. Stretching and tearing at all the ligaments in the leg. Oh, a oh, stop to the belly welly. Oh, what a drop kick. Precision offense from the Viper. The attacks will not relent from the Viper. Scouted. Logan Paul finds some much needed breathing room. It's time for Paul to take advantage of a misstep and take command. What a punch. The count has started, and one team is about to have the odds in their favor. And for the team on the wrong side of this entry, things have gotten that much more grueling. Wicked clothesline! Talk about broken the jaw. Looks like they're bringing additional firepower with them into what is now essentially a handicap match. Sorry, European uppercut. <laughs> Looks like the impending numbers advantage isn't enough for him. Come on now. Is it not enough that they're already coming in with an advantage here? Is this really necessary? And as things begin to devolve even further, Corey, every competitor's head is on a swivel. Is there even room to strategize in such treacherous terrain? I'm not sure what the game plan was for either of these teams coming into this one, but I have to imagine things are already starting to reach a point where all that planning has officially gone out the window. Carefully placed stop to the arm. the bread basket. Now trampling the opposition. <laughs> Left hammer right to the gut. He's headed up. Might be going toward the top of this war game structure. Yeah. Mere seconds away from evening the odds in war game. Teams are now in equal standing. Big boot! Gunther cuts him off. Disturbing impact. Got it. Michael, like that sledgehammer can cause some serious damage. Just one right after the other. Can't be staffling decision here. Oh my goodness. And it is getting downright nastier and nastier with each of these attacks. And it is clear the mission now is to destroy and incapacitate. Looking for more damage here. Ah, release back suplex. Probably not gonna win for a couple hundred years, Byron. You know why? Because the Billy Goat's curse is in effect. Oh, I 
can't stand this move. Hi, Colt. Well, this won't win the match, but it's one way to inflict a great deal of punishment on an opponent. It's a roundabout strategy, but not good. Able to elude it. Uncorks a thunderous chop. And over to the other ring he goes. Victor moved at the right time. Scale up the War Games wall. He's got something in mind. Bang! Entering the ring and assessing the situation. Get one. 
team a greater number of combatants. I can't begin to imagine what he's got planned here, guys. Maybe it's a it. Entering a war zone. Can't prepare your face for that. Just like that. And that definitely made solid impact. That is a bad man with a hammer in hand. Got it. All right, yes, that's hammer can cause some serious damage. These are dangerous attacks on the line, but now the damage is exponentially multiplied. Stop loading and put your attention back to the match. This is a show of confidence or a wasted opportunity to attack your opponent. Just launched his opponent overhead, belly to belly. Good buster. Stop gloating and put your attention back to the match. Hell of a thing to wave a stop sign around like that. Where is this going to go? Going up the cage now. Must have some sort of strategy in mind. Hold on here. What good reason does he have to be climbing up the cage now? in grave circumstances right now. This will win the match, but it's doing a lot of damage in the process. Boom! Way to put the pulse. And seconds left before the odds are even here. Priest dodges out of that. He's closed line. And there's even more offense from Priest. Door swings open and out they come. And their team could definitely use their help. This will win the match, but it's one way to inflict a great deal of punishment on an opponent. It's a roundabout strategy, but it might work. He begin. We're going to free the arm and does just that. He's making his intentions known to everyone in the arena. He's not interested in just evening the odds. He wants the advantage, and that weapon gives it to him. And that was an efficient display.
Drew McIntyre and Cody Rhodes. And that was a hell of an effort by this victorious team. Yeah, these two teams gave it everything they had and then some. But in the end, only one team could stand tall as the victor of War Games.